Okay, what we got here is we have this Detective Comics 578. I had it cleaned and pressed by CCS. Uh, I came back a 9.6 and I looked at it and I thought I might be able to get this to 9.8. So I just broke it open. You can see. I just cut it open, broke it open, cut it out, and then see along the spine there are some spine ticks that I think I can get most of them out. So because it's a Canadian price variant, the difference between 9.6 and 9.8 is probably about three or four hundred dollars. So I thought maybe it's worth it. So here we go. I'm going to press this, send it off to CGC and hope for a 9.8. Okay, I will see you again soon. Thanks. Okay, we got this book before pressing pre-press. So this is the one that I cracked out of the case. So this was graded at a 9.6. So I'm gonna show you why it was probably 9.6. It's mostly along the spine. So you can see a tick, tick. There's actually, I thought there were more than two. So you can see that this book is actually very nice. I'm just gonna spin this around. Just cause I thought there were more than two ticks here the spine. Yeah, there's basically those two ticks. Okay, let's flip this over. And let's start up here. And we'll go along this top edge. So this book is super nice. So maybe this corner. Then the spine, I think there was a tick or two, I think. See those, see that? A bunch of little ticks along there, four or five ticks there. You see that there, I don't know what that is. Little indent, I guess. So this was uh, cleaned and pressed by C CCS. Came back 9.6 and I'm gonna try to get this to 9.8. So let's see if I can do it. See you again soon. All right, we got another book that came out of the pressing system. We have Detective Comics 578. So this is part four of Year Two Batman. Uh, this is a Canadian price variant, the $1 price variant. So let's take a look at this book. So this is the book that I actually cracked open. I had CCS clean and press this, and they came back graded at a 9.6, and I thought that I could get it to a 9.8. So let's see, what do you think if I got, let me let me know if you think I got this to a 9.8. So you can see, the, like, there's nothing, maybe, is there a little ding there? I don't know. You can see like so far there's the book looks great so let's keep going so i think the front no nope. the front there's nothing i can see i think on this book So let's just make sure along the spine, because that's where all the dings were. There were a lot of uh, dings along the spine. So let's just make sure that they're all out, or most of them. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Okay, so let's flip this over and check out the back. Okay, so let's start in the top corner. It's good. So corners are sharp too, so... Going along this uh, left edge is all good. 
but it looks good. So I think the only things that could drop this to grade is coming up on the spine here. So let's see if you can see anything here. Can you see that? So if you look straight on, you can't even see anything. But I think it's a little bit of gloss that got scraped off at some time. And then let's see what else can we see going up the spine. So there were lots of dings on this back spine too. So you can maybe see remnants of right there. Very, very tiny though. Maybe one right there. Can you see that? Okay, let's see the rest of the back cover. So I think the rest of the back cover is pretty good. Yeah, I don't think there's anything. Sure. Okay, what do you think this is gonna be? Do you think I got it to a 9.8? I actually think I got it to a 9.8. So I think this is 9.8. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks. All right. Thanks for joining me for the completion of this journey. For this book, it actually was quite a long journey. So you saw that, you know, uh, it was pressed once before and graded. It came back a 9.6. So I cracked it open. I pressed it again and sent it in. And I was really worried about, there was, a, there was a spine tick that comes back really easily. You can still see it there. So actually I put two boards in the back and I put a board in the front of this book too when I sent it to CGC just so because I didn't want that spine tick to come back but it did. I thought it was going to be 9.8 that's the whole purpose of cracking it open and it came back at 9.8 so it was well worth it. I'm very very happy with that. So thank you for joining me for the journey of this book. Um, you know please do hit the thumbs up subscribe and I really, really appreciate you watching. So thank you very much. See you again soon.